Well, a new generation has entered the halls of power in Indianapolis. Nick Roberts is wrapping up his first day on the city county council. He's just 23 years old. He's the first Gen Zer we've ever elected to the council. He spoke with News 8's government reporter Gary Berquist. City officials say Nick Roberts is the second youngest counselor ever to serve in this building. He says it's important to make sure the council represents all of Indianapolis. Roberts is still settling into his new job. He says he's been meeting with department heads and constituents ever since the election. It was extremely humbling to take the oath of office. You know, I worked so hard for this over the last couple of years. Roberts represents District 4 in northeastern Lawrence Township. He says his family has lived in that area for four generations. He says his young age means he brings a different and much needed perspective. You know, I think being a 23 year old, you know, I think there's a lot of different issues that we might uh, see that other people might not. As somebody that's never bought a house before, I may have a different perspective on the housing market of Indianapolis. Whether we like it or not, you know, young people are a very important part of the city, right? So young people deserve a voice in their own government. Roberts highlighted public safety in his campaign, including security concerns in the area surrounding the Castleton Square Mall. He says he wants to get started right away on projects meant to help that part of town. If we really want to improve Castleton, you know, in terms of the crime perspective, we really have to make sure quality of life, we make it a desirable place to live, you know, impact the property values in a positive way. And there's a lot of exciting development. The nickel plate trails coming in. He says right now he's focusing on getting up to speed on existing projects in his district, such as the nickel plate trail extension. It will take him some time to learn the ropes. But even if the job is new, he says the mentality is not. I was always kind of taught from a young age, you know, give yourself into something that's bigger than yourself. And to me, public service, you know, I think many people think of it for the negative side of it, kind of the self-serving elements of politics. There's a lot of good that can be had, too, and we need people in there that are, you know, just hard workers, that are, you know, uh, objective with kind of how they view issues, not coming at it from any biases one way or the other. Um, and just having, again, that work ethic to get up in the day, you know, get to work for your area and talk to everybody. As with the other 24 members of the City County Council, Roberts' term will run through the end of 2027. At the City County Building, I'm Garrett Bergquist for Wish TV, wishtv.com, and like us on Facebook.